Do you know that women generally fall into six basic body shapes? They've been given all sorts of names and all sorts of descriptions, but I like to use the basic shapes for easier understanding and easier memorability. So what are the six body shapes? Over the next couple of episodes, I shall take you through how to dress your body shape as well as how to accentuate your best assets. But for now, let's find out what the body shapes are. The hourglass is considered the fashion ideal. This is where your hips and your shoulders are well balanced and you have a well-defined waistline. We then have the figure eight. The figure eight is sort of like the hourglass but a fuller version of the hourglass. This is where your hips and your shoulders are also well balanced but you have a higher hip curve and a fuller bust area. We then have the rectangle. The rectangle is where your shoulders and your hips as well as your waistline are almost straight through and through but like every other supermodel you look great in almost anything. And then we have the oval. This is where you have fullness around your tummy area but your shoulders and your hips are still well balanced. Then we have the triangle. This is where your hips are wider than your shoulders but you have a well-defined waistline. And last but not least, we have the inverted triangle. This is where your shoulder and your bust area is wider than your hip area and your legs are your best assets. Trying to figure out where you fall? It's really simple. How I like to advise people is to think about where all the weight goes when you gain weight and where it leaves last when you're trying to lose weight. That will help you determine your body shape because ideally your body shape doesn't change that much regardless of your weight gain or loss. Still can't figure it out? Don't fret, like I said. On the next couple of videos, we shall be talking about each of the body shapes and we shall let you know exactly how you can identify yourself. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And if you have any questions, use the hashtag AskOlive and we shall include them in all our videos.